I'm back. Who's ready for another exercise using the BOSU ball? My favorite piece of equipment. Hopefully you've purchased it. If not, you can do it on the floor. So here we go. This is primarily for the triceps, but again, it's going to engage the core, which you know I love. So that instability of your hands on that ball makes for extra core engagement. Okay, so we're gonna sit down on our ball. Hands behind you, chest up, shoulders back. So make sure your shoulders are not rounding forward. Press back. Walk your feet out. Now either you can keep your knees bent here or you can take your legs straight out in front of you, depending on how advanced you feel. So, and there's no competition here, right? So we're gonna start by bending the elbows, sitting down, keeping those elbows pointing back behind you, chest open, shoulders back. Press it up. Sit down, push it up. Two, push it up. Three, push it up. Four, push it up. Five, push it up. Six, push it up, bending those elbows. Seven, how about double time for eight? We go eight, seven, and six, five, four, three, two, one. Good job, and come on back. Okay, so what do we have here? We've gotten a lot of exercises just using this BOSU ball. So I've shown you all these little bits and pieces here and there. So you can take maybe the tricep dip exercise, do four sets of 15 to 20 or eight slow, eight fast, right? And then maybe you're gonna do the plank where you jump back to jump up to a squat with the military press. And then maybe you're gonna do some core exercises. So you can kind of piece together all these little um, movements that I've shown you and create your own workout at home in 30 minutes or less and with one piece of equipment, just a ball. So try it out, let me know how it goes and we'll see you soon. Bye.